Lectures on an Abacus. Hello everyone. Get ready to do some maths exercise. Today you are going to develop your concept of place value using an abacus. Activity 1. You will use this abacus to write number symbols and number names. The column with the letter H is the hundreds column. The column with the letter T is the tens column. And the column with the letter O is the ones column. Let's do the first one together. Write the number symbol shown on this abacus. There are eight counters in the hundreds column, so there are eight hundreds. There are three counters in the tens column, so there are three tens. And there are six counters in the ones column, so there are six ones. So the number shown on the abacus is 836. Here is another one. Write the number symbol shown on this abacus. There are five counters in the hundreds column, so there are five hundreds. There are zero counters in the tens column, so there are zero tens. And there are three counters in the ones column, so there are three ones. Five hundreds, zero tens, and three ones make five hundred and three. So the number shown on the abacus is 503. Here is another one. Write the number symbol shown on this abacus. There are two counters in the hundreds column, so there are two hundreds. There are three counters in the tens column, so there are three tens. And there are zero counters in the ones column, so there are zero ones. So the number shown on the abacus is 230. Activity 2. This time, let's write the number name shown on this abacus. Ready? There are six counters in the hundreds column. So there are six hundreds. There are three counters in the tens column. So there are three tens. And there's only one counter in the ones column. So there is one one. The number shown on the abacus is 631. So we write the number name. 631. What about this one? There are nine counters in the hundreds column, so there are nine hundreds. There are zero counters in the tens column, so there are zero tens. And there are three counters in the ones column, so there are three ones. The number shown on the abacus is 903. So we write 903. Nice. Here is one more. There are eight hundreds, six tens, and zero ones. So the number shown on the abacus is 860. We write the number name 860. Activity 3. Write the number you would get if you added six more ones to this number. First, let's write down the number shown on this abacus. There are eight hundreds, three tens, and six ones. 
So the number shown on this abacus is 836. Now we add 6 more to this number. 836 and 6 is 842. Well done! That was such a great maths challenge. See you next time.